With a new year comes dry January for a lot of folks and an idea to encourage people to give up alcohol for the month of January. As many people are aware, drinking too much can certainly be harmful to your health. I tell patients all the time, uh, alcohol causes over 200 different uh, medical diseases. It's associated with 200 different medical diseases from from obviously liver disease to li heart disease to different cancers to mental health issues. And see that glass of wine? That's like two glasses. An addiction specialist with Cleveland Clinic says this should be a time to reflect this month. For example, you might realize that you were drinking more than you thought. Going sober, though, it can help improve your mood, your energy levels, improve your cholesterol and blood pressure. You might also lose weight because alcohol is high in calories and even sleep better. And there are some social benefits as well. Removing the alcohol from the social setting, a lot of folks will come back and tell me that they actually have more meaningful conversations and they do other things than go to the bar with their friends and family. They'll go on walks, they'll go to the gym, they'll go play board games at home. Um, it's a really nice experiment to understand that you don't have to have alcohol to interact with people. Great point. Now, dry January is not recommended for people who might be alcoholics or real heavy drinkers as they could experience dangerous withdrawal symptoms. It is best for those folks to first consult with your doctor.